And a very good day to you. Thanks for coming by PosterCentral.com's video blog today. I'm Pete Howard, and boy, any time you can see the original artwork for any of the famous San Francisco concert poster images, it is a thrill because they're absolutely unique. And uh, take a look at this. Heaven's sakes, very familiar image to any fan of San Francisco rock, known as FD2 to fans and collectors, and of course that was the second organized formal family dog dance concert held back in February of 1966 and known as King Kong Memorial Dance. And this is just what it implies, the term original artwork. This is the original camera ready mock-up which was shot to form the basis of the poster. And the poster you're all very familiar with, it's awful darn close to this, and this is of course, the image of the poster, just so I can talk about it for a second, and uh, not color corrected, by the way. But uh, this, uh, this, uh, the original artwork has everything this poster has, except for the new Wes Wilson-designed Family Dog logo in the upper left-hand corner, first poster and handbill that appeared on, and in the upper right, of course, the King Kong Memorial Dance. So that, in fact, if I kind of, kind of segue from one to the other, <laughs> see, it's not on the original artwork. Those two were added at the printers or whatnot. Um, but it has everything else on this, including cut-out letters, almost ransom note style, for the Great Society, with an exclamation point, by the way, on the Great Society. So, as you know, this was a very early family dog dance, back when the, uh, the family dog, headed by Chet Helms and John Carpenter, um, was cooperating and working together with Bill Graham, going back and forth by using the Fillmore on alternate weekends. Now, what's amazing about original artwork to me, and was a real surprise, is that usually in many forms of the graphic arts world, uh, the originals are larger than the final product. They create big images and then shrink it down. You have lots of detail and everything. So I was really uh, just amazed to see that this and, and other original Family Dog artworks, um, instead of being larger and shrunk down, they're smaller and they were blown up. And of course, the you know the posters were all 14 by 20 inches, as we know. And this thing is about half of that size. This is approximately 7 by 10 inches. So that just really surprised me. When you blow up an image, of course, you lose resolution and stuff. But things were very casual, and who cares back then? That's fine. So uh, just quickly running through the bands, like I always to do with any poster or artwork or whatnot. I don't need to tell you the Great, the great Society there headlining featured Grace Slick. And uh, second build, or shouldn't be really second build. Under that, the Grassroots would achieve great top 40 success for years to come, starting with this summer. But as of this point, they had not charted any hits, which of course is why they weren't headlining. Big Brother and the Holding Company, they played publicly just a month or two ago for the first time, and uh, Janice would not join them for a few months after this. And then you have Quicksilver Messenger Service. For some reason, Quick and Silver are separated on the artwork. Um, but uh, they had debuted with that name just a couple of months earlier at a Christmas party. So, boy, just a real thrill to hold this and show it to you. What a, what a kick. And you know something? I saved the coolest thing for last. As we turn this around, look at this. <laughs> um, this was simply cut out of a magazine. This picture of the big ape, the big gorilla, was cut. It looks like maybe Life magazine or Look or the Saturday Evening Post, you know, one of those regular weekly picture magazines that existed in the 60s. And uh, there's pictures of other simians and everything, and you can just tell it's right out of one of those magazines. So I presume Chet cut it out, and then Wes went to work on the lettering and everything. So that's original artwork when you can see both sides. That's really happening, isn't it? So <laughs> that's just great stuff. So, hope you enjoyed seeing this. It was great fun showing it to you, and uh, we'll be back next time with something else. I don't know if it'll be original art, but hopefully something cool. So thanks for coming by, and we'll see you then. Okay, bye-bye.